It was Labor Day weekend, kind of early September, just the start of fall. We had ventured off in the north part of Algonquin Park. The park is known to be quite busy, especially during long weekends. Thankfully, this was a last minute trip and we knew the water levels were up. So we kind of took a uh, express route through a creek that can be difficult during low water. And this kind of allowed us to uh, kind of take an expressway into some of the deeper portions and less busy areas of Algonquin. Wow, so a lot better for doing the portage. Paddle along the creek was quite nice. The route did involve some portaging, um, but with combination of all the wines, okay, we got a it was a late start to the day, and we realized we couldn't really make it to where we anticipated we could make it. So we ended up actually having to uh, basically crash just before um, the lake we wanted to get to. Um, there was a bit of a bit of a pond, and a clear landing kind of seeing the split of the satellite imagery there and next day pretty much started at the lake we wanted to camp at day two <laughs> The second day here involved uh, a series of smaller kind of portages, a few maybe one kilometer portages, a combined total maybe like 3.5k. On average, we did about three kilometers per day. Considering nice. we didn't have a Kevlar canoe and like, we had to basically do two trips, so that is the equivalent of nine kilometers of trekking. We ended up finding a great spot on a point of three mile lake. I guess it's better than nothing. That's beautiful. Day three involved a three kilometer portage that kind of sucked. It involved a fair amount of elevation. Uh, we kind of took it in steps. Uh, we yeah, basically had to. Uh, my canoe is 70 plus pounds. After the previous two days of portaging, um, I was really starting to feel it here. I think my neck was almost broken. Like... <laughs> oh, yeah, it was actually decent. Was it? That's a good sign though. It's like one cat. One Pretty good There's really no cure like good fishing. Uh, my pain just seemed to go away once I started hooking into some decent bass. So day four, we left our comfy island site and the plan was to get back to kiosk, to basically call it a trip. 
Uh, we kind of faced a bit of a headwind, but it was quite manageable. The weather was clear, uh, as you can see. Uh, the day involved about three to four portages, kind of similar to every other day. Uh, a fair amount more paddling though, um, in distance, uh, two big lakes. Thankfully, we didn't have too much of a headwind. Thank you. 